Well, good morning, good morning. Um, Saturday, Saturday, uh, no need for me to go to the office today, so there is a need for me to do stuff for me. And what we're going to start on is flatting the varnish. Now, the chest of drawers I'm working on has got six drawers, but I can only put four of them on my bench. They've all had the horrible paint removed. They've all been stained. I'm not 100% happy with the way the staining went. There's, there's a few blemishes and dinks, um, but I'm going to have to live with that. And they've all had one coat of varnish. Now there's only one way to do this job, to do it, uh, do it properly as it were, and that's to flat the varnish down. And what I'm going to be using is very fine grit wet and dry uh, paper. So go to your mum's cupboard, take out the best dessert bowl that you can find, put some water in it, and that's going to be for keeping the wet and dry wet. Uh, and then it's elbow grease and being gentle. Uh, you flat it down until it feels nice and smooth, then you give it another coat of varnish, and you let it dry, and then you run your hands over it, and then you flat it down until it feels smooth. And, you know, you might end up doing two, three, four, seventeen coats of varnish before you're happy with it. But, you know, that's all a question for individual taste. So I'm going to be doing some of that. Uh, what else have I got to do? Oh, I've got to drink tea. There's a law that says that Englishmen must drink tea. Uh, and I'm going to be doing some stuff on the model railway. Yes, the uh, this layout is booked for an exhibition in May. And so I really feel a need to uh, to move it along a bit and make it sort of nearer complete. I've got two jobs that I'm up to presently. Uh, one concerns this area here. And it needs paving. It needs a surface for, I don't know, railwaymen to walk on or trucks to drive on. And... I came across a, uh, an image that I've, I quite like. Um, cobbles. But what I haven't been able to find is anyone that can give me, hand me, sell me cheaply, any sort of nice cobble effect. So I've been thinking about that, and I do know how I'm going to solve the problem. I will be showing you what I do with that in a separate video, but we're going to be paving the area around the shed. Uh, I've got to, excuse me while I, uh, I've got to finish the coaling stage. That needs some more coal on it. Uh, and then installing, that's going to go next to the coaling road. Oh yeah. Yeah, lots to do. No time to do it. So I'm going to stop gabbing and do stuff.